Hello, everyone. RPG Kingdom, get here back with some more. Paper Mario, the Thousand Year Door. In the previous video, we were kind of like in the epilogue of chapter one. Now we're about to start chapter two. We learned some side quests or did some side quests, and now we're going to go to chapter two because it's time. For chapter two, the great boogly tree. Boogly, 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 boogly. Boogly. I always forget that I have to hit the button. How about the only one that does that? Boogly Woods. So, Boogly Woods, huh? It looks mysterious, alright. What will we run into next? Uh, okay, just a bit further. And uh, we should be able to see the great tree. The elder and our friends. I'm waiting for us there. Oh, and my little sister, too. Come on, let's go. Okay, well, before we do that, let's get Goombella in because we'll be coming across some enemies we have not fought before. And it'd be great to get them tattled on a sap. You can't really. There we go. Like, you can't. I also don't remember if you hitting a hammer like that was a thing or not in the last game. <laughs> Time to go to work, lovelies. Vivian! You understand what we've got to do, yes? Mm -hmm. A. Find that Mario guy. And B. Steal the map to the Crystal Stars, right? We can just do away with Mario and his friends, can't we? Or is that bad? Oh, bad things happen all the time, Vivian. But you're right about our goals. If my information's correct, Mario should be coming down this road quite soon. You must ambush him here and get that map. Hmm? What's this now? Vivian! Well, it's not your fine over there. Oh, what? You mean this? I found it near that tree over there a while back. Isn't it a gorgeous necklace? It was so lovely. I just had to pick it up. <laughs> Vivian! For oh, shame. Picking up someone's scraps? Disgusting! Greedy! But enough about that. Vivian, my dear Packrat, bring out the sketch of that Mario guy that you got from Gordas. <laughs> what? I, I don't have that. You said it was too Im way too important, so you took it. You should have it. Don't be ridiculous. I don't have that thing. You are in charge of it. You wretched little worm. Blaming me for something you probably screwed up. But I... Oh, what is a Mar... Marilyn? Marilyn? Huh? What's that? A mustachioed fellow? This is no time for such nonsense, you great oaf. Save your games for later. Um, uh, now, now, where was I? You, Vivian, don't tell me you lost our precious sketch. But, listen, I... Look, it's not my fault. I never had the sketch. Silence, you dits! Such impudence. How dare you talk back to me like some rebellious child? It's clear to me that the only ra... Rational... The only... Rational you understand is force. Yeah, punishment, I'll be taking that necklace you just found. Yeah, so sorry. But, 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 Belden. Oh, you're horrid. Oh, what am I to do? This is the youngest sister of the three. This one really picks on her, huh? I don't know whose pictures they're talking about, but you'd think she really lost it. Go, go. I guess that's the middle sister. She seems to like the strong silent type to me. Eh, can't get a good read on this girl at all. What 
is it, Mr. Mustache? Leave us! Scram! Right now! I have no business with you! This shyly woman is certainly selfish and mean. I mean, what a total meanie! You see how cruel she is to her own sister? I wonder what went on between them. Oh, stuff. The cleft, a rockhead jerk with spikes on his noggin. What a rocker. Max HP is two, attack is two, and defense is two. That hard head is a major pain. Fire doesn't hurt, but other types of items are pretty effective usually. Nothing seems to work on it, you can always just run. Earth Tremor should work. If you get it high enough. So. So Earth Tremor. If I remember correctly, the button inputs was not just A back on the GameCube. You had to hit all the other buttons as well. So. It was a little rough. That's a pale piranha. You know about these guys, the famous piranha plants. This colorless subspecies is adapted to Boggly Woods. Ah, the wonders of nature. Max HP is four, attack is two, and defense is zero. If you try to jump on them, they'll totally chomp on you. Bonk. Hmm. I don't think you can actually counter these. Maybe you can, but I'm not entirely certain. Bum, bum, ba, ba, da, da, bum. Bum. Bam! That's some good coins. Oh, these things I can also hit. Well, 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 well. I 
mean, it kind of makes sense that you could do this. But... Hey, a sleepy sheep. Let's go back to Petalburg and sell this for two cents. Honestly, we should just go sell them. There, can you see it? That big tree. That's what I was telling you about. That's where my punies live. That's where we punies live. That's home. Uh, of course it's not just us in there. Lots of jabbies and piters too. Anyway, Mario, follow me. I believe there is a star shard or something hidden here somewhere. I like the floor. You know, just look at the rainbow like that. That's cool. Ah, uh, there might be one, I think, but it's... Maybe it's one that gets flipped. Actually, do I learn the ability here? I think there is one... That has to get flipped here, too. I thought for sure there's... Well, there's something here. Hey, I think that's a flower badge. Hey, FP plus badge. Increase maximum flower points by five, which is pretty good. But it needs three, so it's definitely one of those things that, like... Yes, I have a... Of Slayer Storing FP at each turn battle, but how about we just get that one on instead? So then we have 20 FP. So I'm gonna hold off on probably boosting up my FP for Ben, just focus on some badge points. Uh, well, take a look. It's in a book. And Storm wasn't here before, so I just stalled it. And I can't open it. I thought I could finally save everyone. I'm a fool. Hey, don't take it so hard. It does look sturdy, though. What do we do now? Uh. Uh. Um. Uh. 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 Got it. Mario, over here. Long ago. The puny elder told me about a secret entrance somewhere around here. We'll get in that way. I uh, promise. I don't find it. It's going to be easy. And it won't be. It won't be labeled s secret entrance. Not to be a worry, or But how the heck can we find a secret entrance? Uh, it's hidden by this invisible thingy. We need to find it and remove the thingy. Boy, by removing an enormous thing sounds tough enough, not an invisible one. Uh... Oh, got it! Flurry! Surely, man, Flurry's powers can help us. Oh? Flurry's a refined and dignified lady who lives in these woods. The other says she's a wind spirit who can wield the power of the air with ease. You see where I'm going with this? She can use wind power to blow the thing away. Well, it won't hurt to try. Flurry lives in the deepest corner of the woods, so... Let's head back in that direction and come from 
we came from. <gasps> oh, these woods are the most wonderful in all the world. Yes, indeed. Building a house here was just the finest idea I ever did have. Oh my, yes. This place is so different from the bright flash bulbs of the world I'm used to. Such peace. This negative image of the real world soothes my body and soul. But what's even better is that I, Madame Flurry, grow ever more lovely here. Plus, those squishy, adorable little punies that live in that tree are so nice to me. But, I suppose if I stay here too long, I'll begin to crave hustle and bustle before long. Oh, oh my, it's happening even as I speak! Already I feel the need for drama! That moment of exhilaration when the spotlight shines down on the stage, on me! Surely I was born to be an actress for the ages. It's settled then. I shall rise again. But before I make my stage come back, I simply must whip my body and mind into shape. I'll just have to put on some makeup and make my beauty even more beautiful. Wait a moment. Gone, I tell you. My, my, Kermy. <laughs> That's why I'm somewhat going with, uh, of a Miss Piggy voice. I'm somewhat going for a Miss Piggy voice, uh, with her. Not for any particular reason, but, like, not because she looks like Miss Piggy or anything like that, but she kind of gives the vibe in a way. Yeah, if we head east from here, we'll see Flurry's place in no time. Okay. It's this guy again. Coin! Hey, hey, oh! I got all the hardest new products right here. Look no further. Hey, hey, oh, oh, yee hee. Mini, Mr. Mini. Temporarily makes enemies tiny, dropping their attack power. Oh, done dropping, my man? That's too bad, seriously. It's all hot. I mean, we're st uh, You never know when you're gonna wish you had some of this gear, my man. I'll take my chances for now. Yeah, if you guys remember a few parts ago, I mentioned, um, you know, those kinds of monsters. And I was like, well, there'll, there'll be a way we'll be able to get them at some point, so. That's a dark puff. It's basically a tiny, mean thunderhead. Max HP is three, attack is two, and defense is zero. Sometimes it charges up with electricity. Don't touch it when it does. Youch. You know what I mean, right? Bzzz, shocking. After it charges up, so it'll totally zap you with lightning. Beat it as fast as you can. God, I am so in love with this game. I'm sorry if I keep every time, every time, like, you know, after the battle music, after, you know, 
just everything with this game. And if I keep saying, God, I love this game, I'm sorry. I will not apologize for the person I become when I play this game. Yeah, got it. Nice. Yeah, these ones are a little easier to get that uh, thing on. Ba -da -ba -da. Oh. <laughs> Thunderbolt. <laughs> Thunderbolt. <laughs> Thunder. I'm going to be completely honest. I did not even see the, that here. I don't even know what... I don't know. <laughs> oh. oh, come on. There we go. Got a Shine Sprite. I believe I need at least one more before I can level up a party member again, so... Barely made it. The nerd didn't make it though. I got a quick hammer badge. Damage all enemies on the ground or ceiling. Oh, I think a star piece just fell from there. I don't think I can do that with these guys. What are you doing? Will this actually hurt him? The answer to that question is yes. Eight? Eight! Bam! Oh, I kind of forgot something. Uh, we'll be going back that direction anyway, but I do want to go quickly do something. But we'll do that once we do this thing that we're going to go do. There's something I forgot to do. Excuse me. Uh, maybe she's in here. I don't know if she went for a walk in the woods. I'm breaking your shit. Mad Flurry, hello. If you're here, say something. You mustn't come in here. Oh. oh. Man Flurry, are you there? Is that you? What are you doing? Oh, wait a moment. Those darling squishly little footsteps. Is that you, Bunio? Oh, it's been an age since I saw you last. You poor dear. Is there something you need? Uh, well, the thing is, we have a problem. The great trees. Entry hole is blocked. My puny friends are trapped inside, so they're in a pickle. And Mario needs those crystal stars. It's a train wreck, really. And that's why we need you to come with us and find the secret entrance, man, Flurry. Oh, is that all, dearie? 
came all this way here just for that. My adorable little Punio. You know I would do anything in my power to help you. However, lamentably, I'm in a bit of a bind myself. I just cannot come out. Ah, what's the matter? It's something somewhat embarrassing. But I never go out without my n favorite necklace. I just can't find the blessed thing. I suspect I dropped it on my daily con constitutional. I'd be simply scan- I'd be simply scandalized if anyone saw me without it. So I shan't be going out. I absolutely must have that necklace to highlight my beauty. And that's that. Oh, I totally know how you feel. When I go out, I am all about the accessories. Hey, wait a sec. You lost your necklace? I'm having deja vu. I've been very good been in place before. Big time. I swear, someone just said they found a necklace. What's that? Do you speak up? You, whoever just spoke, do you have some clues as to my necklace whereabouts? If you do, you must help me. Please, be a dear, find it, and bring it back to me. After that, I will most certainly join you and help my squishy little friend, Punio. No way, man, Fury. Flurry, I'm sure Mario can find your necklace. Or it is, he's super. Thanks for asking. You can do it, right, Mario? Nah. Huh? Did you just say nah? Uh, what's wrong with you? Let's go find our necklace. I'm sorry to trouble you so. Why do I get roped into this bullshit? I want my lawyer. There's some bullshit uh, happening here. So who found a necklace? Adam, I told you you blame me for losing the sketch, but you had it. Silence, you twit! Now's not the time to get hung up on stupid details. We must study this sketch. So the funny thing is, uh, the way Mario is is in that sketch there, that's actually how Mario's face looked in the first Paper Mario game. It, it is a little bit, it is slightly different in, you know, every Paper Mario afterwards, but yeah. Wow, this Mario guy looks so manly. Check out that bushy mustache. How handsome. You know something, though, my lovelies? I swear I've seen this gentleman before. Ah, he's missing a mustache. Go, go. Ah, I don't believe this. Vivian, this is, without a doubt, all your fault. I'll be dealing with some strict punishment later, my dearie. Oh, yes, I promise you that. What? That's not fair. You're the one who had the... Uh... Silence, you squirrel brain! Don't you cop... Don't you cop that insolent attitude with me! <sighs> this is not fair. And about that necklace, I was thinking of returning it to you, but no more! Aww. And since you caused this problem, you have to figure out how to find this Mario chump. Oh, cool. Also, I should be, I should be checking this out for you guys. See how we're doing on the map. So I found all the shine sprites. No shine sprites at Flurry's house, but there are some star pieces and there's some star pieces here. And I haven't found anything at the great tree yet. I completely forgot how or where I get my butt stomp from. So yeah, spoiler alert: that's how you get the ones that flip. Did you get a butt, a butt stop at some point? Do I get it here? I don't remember. It's not, I don't think it's part of the curses. Cause I think there's only four curses. And yeah. Excuse me. I'm trying to remember where I learn it from. <laughs> okay, so I'm. Ah, oh, fuck.
Yeah, I'm gonna get a level up, so it don't really matter what I do, but... Level up! Going with the badges. It will be a while before I do go say, yes, I want some HP. But for now, like I said, for now we're sticking with only badge points and flower points. So for this point, for a while now, it's just going to be badge points. Oh, god damn it! <laughs> I swear, if it's four again. Well. <laughs> god damn it. Damn it. Ba -ba -lum. Should've just had Mario hit it with that hammer just so I could, um... Oh, God damn it. Just so I could try to do my best for, uh... That thing raises the defense, doesn't it? Or does that? Mustache or no, you can't be too bright if you come here looking for us. <laughs> and you know why? Because we were waiting for you. Uh-huh. I remember. They're the ones with... Hey, wait a second. <coughs> what do you mean you've been waiting for Mario? That sounds suspicious. <coughs> Excuse me. Me. <laughs> I have no quarrel with you, but I simply can't allow you to hunt for the crystal stars. And so I'll be taking that little map of yours just as soon as I deal with you. Oh, wow, scary lady. How do you know about the map and the crystals? crystals? Have you talked to Princess Peach or something? Hey, now that I think about it, who are you anyway? Me. <laughs> Those who seek names are often disappointed, but if you insist, we'll tell you. We are... Free. Shadow Sisters! The three Shadow Sisters? Vivian, you nincompoop! What are you blabbing about? It's just shadows! The three shadows! Sisters makes us sound less mysterious and less scary. How many times must I remind you? Ah, oh, right, sis. I'm sorry. It's just, it makes me really happy when you call me your sister, so... How insufferably sappy! Oh, you've got some fierce punishment coming your way! Oh, gee whiz! I hate being punished. That's for later, though. First, we have to deal with this Mario and his friends. Let's do it, my lovelies! Marlene! Vivian! That... That might of the three shadows... Relation withheld! We'll be more than enough to win the day! Okay. Cool. 
Why? Why did I have to voice so many characters that have like my voice to go like this? It's most unlike lucky that our sights are set on you. Well, unlucky for you, of course. Marlene, Vivian, let's show them precisely what we can do. Good. <laughs> yes, this. Can't flee this fight. Fuck. We'll go with Vivian first. That's Vivian. She's the youngest of the three shadows. Max HP is 10, attack is 0, or 1, and defense is 0. She doesn't seem all that noteworthy. Uh, she is kind of cute, I guess. She might even be cuter than I am. What the fuck? I guess. Wow, I think I might be jealous. Marlin, she's one of the three si shadows. Feldum's younger sister. Max HP is 12, attack is 2, and defense is 0. She's ch she charges up her attacks occasionally. Says here she's the toughest of the sisters, so it might be best to defeat her first. Huh? Other than that, it doesn't have any particular outstanding characteristics. Time for a sweet treat. More so just to heal me. I guess to maybe get some flower points back. Fuck! Oh my god! So the good news is there's only ever two poison mushrooms, so we've already had them both. So. Fuck! Charge. Attack power is now boosted. That's not good. Oh, that's not good. Now spell them. She's the oldest sister. The other three shadows. Max HP is 9. Attack is 1. And defense is 0. But her blizzard attack has an attack of 2. She can make her part partners big and uh, make us tiny, and attack us with ma weird magic. What we're saying about her is that her sinister snicker. She sounds so totally evil. I mean, she's just the sort of person you want to avoid, like the plague, you know? Boy, I could fucking read. Fuck me. Huge. Could just do sweet treat again. I have nothing better to do. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck me! Well, it's not the greatest, but... Huge. 
God damn it. Ah! You have time for that. I missed a mustache. I guess it's time to stop toying with you, hmm? Hey there, Marlene! Now! Good. What are you doing, Vivian? You twit! I'll never forgive you if you lose! Sorry, sis. Ow. Ow. Now it's up to you. Sorry, sis. Huzzah! We got 30. But we got no coins like we do sometimes when we beat bosses. Ugh. Maybe we are just a touch overconfident. Marlene, Vivian, you lumps! We would have wanted you to pull your weight. Both of you, prepare for a world-class punishment session when we get home. But the necklace... Leave it! Aw. Aw. Oh my god! We got our asses handed to us! That's Larry's necklace, yes. Let's take it to her. Uh-huh, but first let's go do the thing I wanted to do first, and I kinda wish... So, the thing I wanted to do... Is... Back in here. Do you have to leave for a bit, Mario? That's okay. I know they'll come back. So I'll wait right here for you. It'll be a, it'll be a while. Well, not a while, but... Uh, give or take five minutes. I don't know. I'll use this coupon in. This coupon in? This in coupon. God, the music's so great. <laughs> I just love Koops just going like that. I don't think they kept that... Well... Well, hold on. No, Goombella still might have the look. I think Goombella's look is doesn't change because... It can't because her legs are basically her feet. Or face, whatever. But... Anyway, yes, this is where I want to go. I want to do this first. I completely forgot to do this before we went to, um... Boggly Woods. Do a special path. Pretty sure they also made this a little cheaper, too, because I'm pretty sure it was like 100 coins in the original. Okay, hey, that's fine by me. So ready, ready for me. Okay, here we go. <laughs> when Mystic Power can make you smile. In battle, you'll win with style. Even if nasty foes arrive, you'll be fine since my fortune will thrive. Okay, come again. See you soon. See you then. Goodbye. 
I I already explained what uh, that stuff is. So sometimes in battle we might just get a random power boost, we might get a random defense boost, might get a random uh, double experience, which would have been nice if we got that during the uh, the Shadow Sisters fight. Mario, I need you to come back. All right, let's let's get back to it. Yep, I'm back. I'm back again. Back again at the Krispy Kreme. Bonjour, mes amis. I come to warn you that the three shuttles were headed here. Hello, they look like I'm too late. Bonjour, mi ami. Okay, you say the exact same thing. Okay, that's cool. That's, that's that totally gross guy, Dupree. What the heck is that guy doing here? Oh my gosh, you don't think he follows here because he's infatuated with me, do you? And that's not a brag, believe me. I would love to be your own. That was actually kind of hilarious. So let's see if we can get any fortune smiles on me today. both use them. That's fine. I'm actually really happy that like the first skill they give you is, you know, sweet treat. Oh, I thought I hit that. I was like, ah, fuck. There we go. I think that fully healed. No, nah, it didn't fully heal Coops, but. Kind of hoping that the tree falls down. Fuck.
but that was close. I almost went the right into it. Eh, if some of those items have helped me in that fight, probably. Not that big of a deal that I didn't do it, but that's fine too. Barely made it. I'm not so great when it comes oh, shit. to them. I honestly probably would have used my Earth Tremor skill on the Sirens or the Shadows. That's going to be hard to be like, oh yeah, they're called the Shadows now, even though I'm pretty sure they were called the Sirens. Well, I mean, they were called the Shadow Sirens in OG. So, I guess they use Shadows in both, but still. See my precious necklace again. Oh, you delightful fellow. You found my necklace. I'm beside myself, truly. But you still mustn't see me. Please leave the necklace by the door and wait a moment. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, splendid, splendid. My oh so ravishing necklace. I'm a washed in joy! Aww. Mwah, wah, wah. Oh, oh my word! Mario, isn't it? Are you my heroic little necklace hunter? Well, my, my, my. Aren't you a fine specimen of a man? Yes, indeed. Oh, me? What the fuck? Why do all the ladies have the hearts for me? I must... Si I simply must thank you for your generous generousness. But how to do it? Hmm. Perhaps if I grabbed you and gave you a little sugar... You right? Come, handsome. Time to give you a proper thank you. Pucker up. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. oh! Mario died. Game over. Oh, Mario, you are just the cutest little thing I've ever laid eyes on. Yes, you are, and that's that. So tell me, are you truly looking for the crystal stars? The very same crystal stars spoken of by all the lowlives in Rogueport. Mm, a danger-filled search for beautiful jewels. Oh, absolutely marvelous! And here I was thinking how frightfully bored I was. It's time for a change! And besides, I do declare, that plush mustache of yours has completely swooned me. A man as manly as you must attract all sorts of trouble. And I want to keep you safe. So I just dare say I'll be joining you on this little adventure. I assume that's fine, Mario. Flurry joined your party! Flurry's ability, a primer! While pressing X, Flurry will exhale strong gusts of winds that can blow things away. Hold down X to blow the paper away. Okay. If she blows in the direction of an enemy, she can keep its head spinning for a bit. 
Well, that actually makes their head spin. Whee! That concludes the primer. Do you feel like you've mastered Flurry's abilities? I've mastered them! She can also squash enemies in battle with a body slam or blow them all away with gale force. Oh, yes. I am indeed that bitch. This is wonderful. It's so nice that Flurry's Flurry likes you, Mario. Really, it's great. And even more importantly, Flurry's chosen to join us. Let's go to the great tree. Well, yes, but first. Super appeal badge. Get more star points with my partner appeals. Did I show? I also don't remember if I showed Goombella's appeal or not. Uh, I think I showed. Um, I know I showed Coops. Ah, there's the star piece. I know there was a star piece in here, but I couldn't remember. Um. I have three. Damage dodge. So bad. You know what? I haven't heard what these ones do. Can I actually sort them? I can. Type. That's not so bad, I suppose. Yeah, having it this way is fine. Um, I could put Happy Flower on. Quick Hammer. It's used to attack which damages all enemies on ground and the ceiling. Warning two or more of these badges increase the attack power, but the move will require more FP. Oh. Um. Ooh, I'm actually curious what happens if I have both of them on. It has both of them. That's interesting. Okay, it's right. When will the next time I be that I completely forget? Because that's probably going to be... Oh, God. I, pff, I almost went the wrong way. I completely forgot that we were in the background here. Womp, womp, womp. Womp, womp, womp. So, hold on, like right here. So you might be wondering, what the hell am I squeezing? I honestly think I'm just holding on to Flurry. Or like Flurry just has her arm around me to make sure I don't like get blown away or something or to hold her down. Or I might just be, I honestly don't know, but it's, I'm not holding what you think I'm holding. Wait, hold on. Jump in this fight, but that's fine. Oh, god damn it. So, yeah, she has body slam and gale force. Attacks all enemies with a powerful gust of wind. And I blew them away. There's her appeal. And here's my appeal again. I don't know if I have to attack in order to do the bingo. I guess I do. That kind of sucks. Here, let's show off her body slam.
Okay, I completely forgot about that aspect of it. So, yeah. Oh, hey! More coins! The effect of the charm increased your coins threefold. I forgot that that happens too. Yeah, so sometimes that when you end the battle, you know, the stuff that gets brought out could also increase too, like the coin could get tripled. Wait, did I fuck that? What? What? What the fuck? Oh, that did that. Hey, 69. I didn't even see how many star points I or star things I had. Not paying attention to that. I can't remember when it comes to the the effects of those um RDM pro or mere issue. Rogue Port today bring you all the up to the moment news as it happens. We have details of yet another incident at the parlor in West Rogueport. Outraged by the high Pianta prices, Gunferi is suspected of violently shaking the Pianta char changer, causing the Pianta changer's alarm to sound, which led to the Pianta char changer ceasing to function for a brief period. Parlor was forced to close down temporarily. The victim was quoted as saying, I am a machine. No matter how hard I am shook, I feel no pain. End interview. Shop reporter, go. Get all the hot shopping news. At all hot shopping sport spots in the world. Pellberg's your destination. You can't miss the spot that's been at the talk of the town for the last 20 years. Nifty's Shop. The friendly owner has long been thought to be the most eligible bachelor in town. But word is he's secretly in love with a girl at the inn. The wise and witty shopkeeper had this to say. You only live once, so enjoy it while you can. Shop now at good old Nifty's Shop. Cooking for rookies. Interested in cooking but don't know what to cook? Try our chef's delicious suggestion. Today's yummy recipe, mushroom fry. Just season your mushrooms, saute them up, and they're ready for the dinner table. Editor note, we hope you enjoy RDM's premiere issue. You can look forward to future editions coming your way soon. Published by Rogueport Restoration Committee. Um. And now I completely lost track of what the fuck I was saying. Um. Oh right. So the the fortune that I have, I don't. I think I do get a thing saying, "Hey, the fortune's out" or whatever. I think I do get something like that. But oh, hey, there's our battle guru again. Pretty sure there's also a flippy one here too somewhere, but. That's the secret entrance. You can find it inside. Here I go. <laughs> Aren't penis just the most precious little things? Oui. Mario, I feel I must ask. Do you know that I used to be a rather famous actress? I was a diva for the stage. I was known as Madame Fleury the world over. But the filthy air outside the spotlight repelled me. So I came to the woods. Oui. 
And soon enough, I glimpsed the beauty of these punies and their pure little hearts. They remind me of my own innocence as an actress. And that made me realize I shall ever love the stage. I must feel the spotlight shine on me again. I must. As you can see, these dear little punies help me find my true self. That's why I must help them however I can before I go on my own adventures. Oh yeah. Mario, can you hear me? Check it out. I was able to open it from the inside. Come on, over here. The time has come for me to repay my debts to the punies. Come along, Mario. Oh yeah. Hurry up, go inside. Well, if you don't rush me. Uh, weird. Oh, yeah, everyone's right here. What the hey? Hey, out oh, there. Everyone come out. Hello. Oh? Wah, who are you guys? How'd you get in here? Oh, dude, is that... Isn't he that Mario guy? What? He is? Better get in, then. But, dude, Lord Crump told us to tell him immediately we found Mario, remember? You idiot, use your head. If we capture him, we'll get all the credit, man. Duh. Oh, uh, yeah. Right on. Let's rock this chump. One, two, three. Break. That's an X knot. Says here it's classified as an enemy combatant. That description stinks. You think it means they're just low-level foot soldiers? Max HP is 4, attack is 3, and defense is 0. They drink these potions that make them all big and blur burly. Then they attack. One's easy, but if there's two or more, better watch out. Use your partner's moves and items to take them down. Ah, fucking dizzy dial. Oh. Ow! Now, I'll be honest, I'm not a big fan of flurries of things. I always had issues with it in the past, too, like on the GameCube, too, so. Crud. That's done, man. Dude, maybe reporting back to Lord Crumb isn't such a bad idea after all. Pretty slick work handling those guys, Mario. Seriously, way to go. My question remains where did everybody go? I could possibly make everybody leave. Finally, somebody shows up. What are you doing hiding back there? Come out for Pete's sake. I thought I was a powerful ally. He's huge. 
Are you sure your huge mustache of man won't try to eat us? Huh? Hey, who's that? Who else is back there? It's massive. I don't like him. He'll crush us. Danger. Nice stash. It scares me. so burly. Now, don't worry, everyone. This is Mario, and he's our friend. He's here to help. All these bad guys, Mario stomp every one of them. Just like those last goons. Is that it? There's so few. Well, we have to make do. Let me formally introduce Mario. Wait! Wait. How do we really know this really froze our ally? He might be one of them. Puniper, what are you saying? He's not one of them. Listen, we can all fight Alex like Mario and chase those goons out of here. We can take back our tree. <laughs> Big bad Punio. Listen to yourself. Try to sound all important like. You have no idea the kind of troubles we've been through while you were gone. And why are there so few of you here anyway? What happened to everyone? Well, they've been captured by our goons. The elder, everyone, including your sister. That? Petuni? Everyone was captured and taken somewhere within the, this big tree. They said it was because we wouldn't tell them where to find some crystal thing. You told me you never heard of it. No. No, that absolutely tears it. We've all got to go look for them right away. What are you saying, Punio? We can't do anything to those giant goons. And any that hairy old man to our ranks won't help a bit. How can you say that? You can't know that. We have to try, don't you see? Think about it. If we all get together, we can take it on anyone, anywhere. So who's with me, huh? Come on, everyone, let's pull our strength. <laughs> Punio, Punio, Punio. You'll have to convince me because I think you're losing it. Tell you what, you and Mr. Mustache there can get the revolution started. If you can free our friends who got locked up somewhere in the tree, then I'll join your little crusade. Ha! Huh. Like that'll ever happen. Please. Fine, we'll show you. Right, Mario? Right? Come on, follow me to glory. Let's go help them. Oh boy. Well, we have ourselves a big task to take on in this big tree. But that's going to do it for this part of Let's Play Paper Mario, The Thousand Year Door. In the next part, guys, we do just that. Thank you all so much for watching this video. Guys, if you liked the video, please give that like button a click. And comment down below, check about the video, didn't like about the video. And let me know, guys, what do you think of Madam Flurry here and the, does the extent of the Boggly Woods here? And our first encounter with the, si uh, with the shadows. Ooh. Let me know. And as always, guys, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss a beat. And subscribe to my main channel, too. That's in the description below. As well as follow me on Twitter. Both my main Twitter, the RBG Kim Kid Twitter, are in there, too. Thank you all so much for watching once again. And I'll see you all next time.